Is this not my proof that cops are protecting criminals? Hey, County Sheriff's Office, if you have an emergency or need a deputy's response, please press zero now. Wait while I transfer your call. Yes, is this the Bay County Sheriff's Department in uh, in uh, Bay County, Florida? It is. Who am I speaking to, please? Operator 372. Okay, Operator 372, I would like to report a super loud car stereo just about busted the windows in my place as of October 8, 2015, around 8 o'clock. I've tried to get the Panama City Police Department to do something about this vehicle. I want him arrested under 3015 of the Florida statutes. He's probably gone down to the, uh, to the clubs down there on Panama City Beach to sell his drugs. I want him arrested, and I, try, and I talked to Sergeant uh, Officer Evans over the phone in Panama City, and he's saying, well, you want to... You want somebody to come out and talk to you? In the meantime, this drug dealer is getting away. I want Officer Evans arrested as under a conspiracy under 838 of the Florida statutes to protect an American terrorist, these boom car punks. Do I have a right to live in my home in peace? Unless you want to speak to a supervisor on the phone. Oh, really? Oh, so in other words, what you're telling me is every time that somebody reports a crime, you all got to get, you got to ask the people that are complaining. In the meantime, the criminal gets away, right? Sir, that's what they do. They come and talk to you in reference to what it is that you're complaining oh, about. Oh, in other words, what you're saying is that we don't need the cops in the first place, right? They're too stupid to find the criminals, right? Is that what you're telling me? You can call me back whenever you decide on what it is that you would rather us do. Other than that, I'll tell you exactly what I want you to do. I want you to arrest this long, uh, older model SUV. I want. Uh, uh, let me ask you something. Is the sheriff's department? Are they getting paid off? Are they getting paid off by these drug dealers to look the other way? Uh, I want to know. Do I have a right to live in my home in peace? Now, I gave you the statute under 3015 of Florida statutes of where you can arrest them. Officer Evans, Panama City Police Department. Yes, um, I'm trying to report a super loud car stereo, a, okay. a, a, a black SUV. What area, what area is that in? Okay, right now... Sure, I'll, I'll, I'll get an officer in the area for you if you tell me where they're at. Oh. Let me explain something to you, Officer Evans, okay? Uh, I'll get an officer in the area for you. Let, let me explain around. something to you, okay? I know you terrorize homeless people right, in McKinney Park. In the area for you. I know I'm that. Today. Yeah, I'll tell you exactly where. All right, bye-bye. Hey. Hey. How you doing, uh, Melissa? Um, I'm trying to report a super loud car stereo just about busted the windows. I, I have complained eight times about this super. It's a older model black. Uh, kind of like an SUV, I think it's called a GMC or whatever it is. Um, black in color, uh, as of October 8, 2015, going down the road, you could hear him like half a mile down the road. I'd like to have him... Where was he going, sir? Pardon me? Pardon me, what Melissa? What direction was he going? Pardon me, Melissa, what'd you say? What direction was he going? He was going from... From east to west. And see, the... Okay, what was the closest cross street that he was coming from? What road was okay, he on? Okay, this is about maybe 10 or 15 minutes ago when I tried getting the Panama City cops to do something about it. He would have probably okay, been down... Sir, was, I need to know what road he was on. He was on... It's either called Highway 98 or 15th Street. Highway 98, okay. And, I, and, and Melissa, I, this is the eighth time that I called... And I'm wondering, is he paying off the cops? Is he a drug dealer or something? Okay, uh, sir, I can have an officer below for that vehicle. Is there anything else we can do for you at this time? 
I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statute. Okay, we'll have to find the vehicle first, so I'm going to have an officer uh, on board. Okay? Uh, uh, Melissa, we'll Melissa, all you got to do is set a vehicle out there with, uh, with take, turn off your radar gun so they can't detect. You go down to Carl Gray Park down there at the foot of Hathaway Bridge. He'll probably be back over in about 15 more minutes with another to get another drug shipment. I want him arrested, and I want him thrown in jail. I want him thrown in jail. Anything else we can do for you sir? Anything else we can do for you at this time other than try to locate that vehicle? I want to know something. I want to know why Officer Evans has no mercy on homeless people quietly drinking a beer in the park, but you all can't find these boom cars? Yes. Okay, Officer Evans is not on the road at this time. Is there anything else we can do for you? I want that. Uh, I'm trying, Melissa. I'm and trying to give you. I'm trying to give you a sure description you of the vehicle. Is there anything else Melissa, we can do? Melissa, why are you interrupting me? I'm trying to give you a description of the vehicle. Why won't you let me give a description? Model black GMC SUV that was eastbound to westbound for high, on Highway 98. Yes. And see here's and he comes in through every fifteen minutes. Is there anything else? That, that's what looks to me like. Looks like to me he's going to get another drug shipment in Panama City, Florida. Okay, okay. to go you. sell it at the we'll clubs down the there on the beach. Thank you. Bye bye. I want him arrested. Yes, Officer Evans, as of October 13, 2015, I would like to report that super same, the loud car stereo, long SUV, as of 2015, just came by. He's probably down by uh, Michigan Avenue and 15th Street. I want him arrested. I want him thrown in jail. This is the ninth time that I have complained about this loud car stereo. Rattled my whole windows in my place. Is it possible to have him arrested? Or is he a drug dealer for the cops? We can send somebody down there for you. Where'd you say he was at? 15th and where? Um, he's probably, as I'm talking to you right now, first of all, Officer Evans, he was going at a high rate of speed. I could, on the front of his vehicle, there's no tags on his vehicle on the front. The state of Florida does not require tags on the front. So the only thing I can do is give you a description. I think it was probably a GMC, uh, long, older, kind of boxy SUV, uh, black, uh, you know, SUV. This is the ninth time that I've called the Panama City Police Department and the Sheriff's Department about this sure. punk. I want him arrested. Sure. Okay, on so I can understand you, please. Officer Evans, I want him arrested and I want him thrown in jail. I can send an officer there for you. He said it's 15th Street and where? Uh, as of right now, officer, as I'm talking to you right now, so it's the speed he's going. He's probably down by the Hathaway Bridge right now, probably going over uh, to sell drugs on the beach there to the, uh, to, to, to the clubs down there. Uh, I can't understand. Let a, let a homeless person like, uh, you know, Patricia Wilder be quietly drinking a beer and Officer Gray surveillances her and arrest her for quietly drinking a beer but these punks can go up and down the road. Do I have a right to live in peace in my home, Officer Evans? Sir, where did you see the vehicle? I'd like to know. Yeah, as I'm talking to you right now, he's probably over the Hathaway Bridge right now. I want the Bay County Sheriff's Department to arrest him under 3015 of the Florida statute. Is that possible? Sir, where did you see the vehicle at? Okay, where I saw him at? What do you mean? I'm telling you approximately where he is right now. Now I don't need to know where he is right now. I can, I can figure that out if you tell me where he's at or where you saw him at. First of all, I don't have any wheels on my house. I'm trying to live in my home at, you know, on peace uh, about 6.30 right now, you know, October 13, 2015, in my home. I want to know, do I have a right to live in my home in peace? Tell me where he's at the further away they can get. So if you tell me where he's okay, at, I want the Bay, right now I want the Bay County Sheriff's Department to arrest him under 3015 of Florida statutes. I want him arrested. Not the Bay County Sheriff's Office. This is Panama City Police. That, that's right. That's right. And you can contact the Bay County Sheriff's Department, and you can set out a, a surveillance undercover vehicle. Get him out of McKenzie Park where they terrorize the homeless people.
and put him down by Carl Gray Park, which is going on, you know, you know, where he's going from from east to west, and you can arrest him and you can circumvent him. So where did you see the vehicle at? Where I saw him. I'm telling you approximately where he is right now. What difference does it tell what difference does it make if I tell you where he's at? I want to know why this punk. I want to know why this punk can go up and down the road, robbing my right to live in my home in peace, and thousands of other people. I want him arrested under the terrorist statute under 876 of the Florida statutes. Sir, so where did you see the vehicle? Coming back down the road right now. Sir, so where did yep, you see okay. the vehicle? Yep. Okay. The 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 black SUV just came from going from. West to east, he's probably down by Lisenby Avenue right now, um, going from from west to east right now. Just came back. I guess he just didn't make his drug deal, his connections. I want him arrested. I want him thrown in jail. Hey, so we'll get somebody over to 15th and Muslim before you, okay? I don't know where he is right now. I don't have no wheels on my house. Sir, I thought you just said you just lost the vehicle. That's right. right. He just came back. He just came back. And what I'm trying to do, officer, is I'm trying to give you approximately where he is because I don't have no wheels on my house. Just came back down the road. I want him arrested. I want him thrown in jail. What officer? I get somebody over there for you. I want him arrested and I want him thrown in jail. Or I'm going to assume it's he. That'll be that officer's discretion if he finds the vehicle. Oh, in other words, he can racketeer. He can protect the drug dealers. He can protect the American terrorists. Is that what you mean by officer discretion? What do you mean by that? I want him arrested, no. Officer Evans. No. I want him Good. thrown in jail. No, I want him thrown in jail. Notice that they use interrupting techniques on me. They talk over me. It's like their 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 mamas didn't teach them any motherfucking manners. They are using all different kinds of techniques to frustrate me. Which proves to me when he said offers discretion, sounds to me like all they got to do is just the drug dealers pay off the cops. This is what it looks like to me is going on in Panama City, Florida. As of uh, October uh, 8, 2015. And I've been reporting on these boom cars for years trying to live in peace. But uh, it seems to me that the cops are part of a terrorist organization. They're protecting them. And with us citizens, we can't say who the terrorists are? How do we know that the cops ain't the motherfucking terrorists? Jim Bikeman signing off.